Welcome Aquarius to your reading. I am Angel, the mediator of light and dark, and this is your August 2024 reading. Guys, welcome to any and all new subscribers of the channel. Okay, you have a full O taken a new beginning. Are you leaping off that cliff? Okay, so you're <laughs> you're leaving someone something behind. Could be an earth sign. Someone who's been grounded and stable. What is going on? Aquarius. Okay, but you're seeing something for what it is. You have been through a lot with this person. And now you are setting your sights clearly on something else. This is a whole different path. Six of Pentacles. You're ready to give to this to the situation here. Where you were not in the past. There's been oh so the the illusions have been clearly seen by you and you're like trying to surface oh look at the problems. You're trying to surface for air. That's why you're choosing to move into a different direction. Yeah, you, okay, so this is, this is a learning. Look at the pentacles in a line. This is a learning for sure. I want to say where... I want to say you want to let sleeping dogs lie. That is just a, a scenario, a, a terminology. A, a, that is what I'm getting out of this. You'd rather let sleeping dogs lie where they may and fortify yourself. To nourish yourself, you're going to need to let sleeping dogs lie. Wow. Bottom of the deck. Oh, look at this. <laughs> you're just, you're broken hearted. There's been two deep wounds that you just cannot seem to get over. Okay. And it's... It, what I'm seeing deeply is that this tether right here, it wraps around you. And you cannot seem to let it go. And there has been no effort on your part, on their part. And it's kind of like, well, since this has not progressed, not been trying to um, make a healing note of things, right? You're, you're at a position now where there's a fire that's been lit underneath you. And now you're at the point of, there's different options how do you go about this when it comes to the lover's energy? I want to say them them looking. This is either you or them looking at yourself in the mirror, right? As a reflective note. And I want to say it's them because it's it's actually giving you a headache. So everything. It's almost as if it's an illusion that you need to get yourself out of. So, but leaving this person's going to be a lot. Okay, because you are romantically intertwined.
but underneath that is giving you a headache, right? Look, look, the devil. So they could be some addictions. Uh, it could be just a generalized pull towards them. Look, they're like, no, you need to come with me. And then under that, you're like, but no, I've had enough. <laughs> Look at this. I'm going for a different path. Look, I'm no longer setting my sights on something out the window. Okay, you're going to ask me to go within and to meditate on on what i'm doing it for myself so it's gonna be like a push and pull energy and you're gonna be like uh-uh i love myself i see myself somewhere else and i'm gonna hold on to that rebirth because there is some place unknown my destiny my universe is somewhere else within me, and I know it. I'm just feeling this movement that's coming from me. It's got that, that my passion's burning, right? For someone who, who wants to celebrate life with me and not work against me as the devil is what I'm saying, right? Look at this. You want someone who's going to love their self fully and reach the highest destination of commitment with you that you can reach. And someone that's just willing to just take off on a whim and, and fly off to, the new, to a new destination where this person here is like so grounded, right, that a plane would probably scare them. I just heard right. So I know that's right for someone. Let's see. Give me one spirit. One affirmation. If you could tell them anything in this deck. Tell them. There you go. Openness. Openness creates an allowance of the self to be without judgment. Openness breaks down barriers, melts away fears, and allows creativity and communication to flow. Check your feelings. When you are being open, there will be no need to feel defensive. Let go all levels of fear, doubt, worry, and concern, and what you have left will be confidence, self-esteem, and love. All of which function very well with openness. And that's why I was seeing this Queen of Cups here. You're going to go from not knowing where you're going, seeing yourself where you are with this person, and then taking the leap of faith saying, I need to... I need to take a stand for myself and hold on to who I am. You know who you are. And you know what you deserve. And you're not going to let anything from what I see, now it could change. But the next card is moving on, right? And leaving the past behind, all the emotional turmoil and using your intuition about it to go find your emperor, check you out. Because you know you can do it. Look at how beautiful, look at how abundant she is. Just to have peace. That you can pick the peace is enough satisfaction for you. So guys, I'm going to conclude this video, Aquarius. Wow, that has been a blessing. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it that thumbs up. And if you want to give God a good laugh, tell him your plans. And thank you for letting me take a glimpse into your life.
Namaste.